Welcome to booktube. My name is Brenna Green. This is my channel pineapple strawberry today I'm gonna be doing a book talk on under a painted sky by Stacey Lee I got this from the library obviously because I can't tell what it says right here Wait, let me look it up. It's been bothering me ever since I started this book What drew me to this book was the cover because look at this look at this beautiful bind cover bro Two girls hidden in plain sight one daring journey to freedom. Okay, so now I feel better about my life. This book is about a girl named Samantha. She kills a man because he tries to rape her. She realizes that she can't just get away with it by saying that it's self-defense because there's a law and she will go to jail. So she flees. Before she flees, she meets this girl named Anime and she's a slave and she's tried to run away before. So Anime decides to give running away another chance. So she goes with Samantha. They realize that their gender and their race, which is girls and black and Chinese, will make them stand out like a sore thumb when they're trying to escape so they transform into boys. Samantha becomes Sammy and anime becomes Andy. Soon they meet cowboys and they all just have like super wild adventures while trying not to be caught by the police and while trying to keep their identity a secret. Let me just start off by saying this book was so incredible. Like most of my book talks are gonna be incredible books. There were so many adventures. Um, I definitely enjoyed the second half of this book more than the first half of this book because the farther I got in the more adventures there were and the more like page turny it got. So I found myself in the beginning of the book reading like 10 pages at a time and then towards the end of the book I found myself reading like a hundred pages at a time so I think it took me like a week to finish like the first half and then two days to finish the second half it was so good there were so many life or death situations in this book because obviously this girl is wanted because she killed a guy and she ran off with a slave so while they're with these cowboys they learn a whole nother lifestyle and you see them kind of transform throughout the story which is so amazing I really really like the family aspect of this story. They don't have perfect families, but they become each other's family. It's honestly life-changing and I think everybody needs to read this book. You can take so much away from it, especially considering there's diverse characters, different lifestyles, different races, different religions. They all have very unique backstories which kind of make them into the person that they are in the story. They all have their own way of thinking what life means. Not even gonna lie, I actually considered not even doing a book talk for this book because it's just so good and so jam-packed full of adventures that me talking about how good this book is doesn't do this book justice. It's so good. Like, it's just, I just can't say anything more. It's just a story about just friendship and family and love and sacrifice and it's so good. You just read it. Just get back to me and you're gonna be like, wow, Brenna, thank you. Thank you for <laughs> giving me this book recommendation. It's great. And you're probably gonna fall in love with at least one of the cowboys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!